Hi, this is Keith Larson with Control Magazine. I'm here at the Emerson Exchange Studio, and joining me today is uh, Mike Browse. We're going to be talking about a new um, platform for upskilling workforce um, here today, so excited to catch up on that. It's called the Performance, uh, what do you call the it? The Performance it? Learning Platform. Performance Learning Platform. Can you tell us a little bit more about that, what the genesis was of that, and, and, yes. uh, and what, what's involved? Sure can. So workforce upskilling and just finding talent mm -hmm. is, is just a big challenge in our industry today. Sure. So clearly, college students and or existing workers mm -hmm. um, really need training on the latest technologies that are used in advanced manufacturing. Mm -hmm. Now, I work in educational services, and we've got a lot of different solutions Absolutely. for those audiences. Mm -hmm. But our latest solution mm -hmm. is called the Performance Learning Platform. Okay. So that platform enables hands-on training on the latest technologies that are used mm -hmm. in a manufacturing plant. Yeah. It's great for refresher training for existing workers. Also really good for teaching the fundamentals to okay. college students. Yeah. It's a lot of automation on yeah. a very small portable footprint. Yeah, I imagine that's useful just for engineers coming out of college because I know I didn't know what a pressure transmitter was after my bachelor's degree, so a lot of it comes on the job, exactly. no doubt about that. So is there a specific curriculum that goes with the platform? We do, so the curriculum, I, just, there's four components to it, so let me break it down into okay. those four components. So the first component of that curriculum is called performance support videos. So these are just YouTube style videos that are available right from the workstation, right from the HMI on the okay. unit. Um, and they cover the most common tasks that are associated with the instruments that are on the, on the platform. Mm -hmm. Second component is a 300 page lab book. Okay. Um, and that lab book covers just a lot of best practices that happen in the industry, covers all that technology, and then there's about 20 hands-on exercises as well. Okay. Third component is e-learning courses. Okay. And then the fourth component we're just debuting here at Emerson Exchange. It's the augmented reality and virtual reality really? component. Okay. And we're pretty excited about that and we'll be releasing that soon. Yeah, that's exciting. So it's really an interesting combination of physical hands-on training with e-learning. So I imagine those really complement each other and reinforce they do. They've been, I think it's just been very well received and we're really looking forward to releasing that last piece of it, that AR and VR yeah. component. Of it. Well that's more and more seems the the assisted worker on using those kind of tools for things they don't use very often. That's yeah. very much an emerging trend in terms of um, making workers more effective and not messing up, <laughs> especially <laughs> things that they don't do very often. Exactly. So the one nice thing about the platform, Keith, is it's just a safe environment. Yeah. So, you know, you're working on a safe environment, nobody's going to get hurt. So. Yeah. So physically, this is uh, something you can wheel, wheel into a classroom or wheel into an office or cubicle? Exactly. Yeah. So it, it's on casters okay. and it'll fit through a normal 30-inch doorway, which okay. was one of our de design criteria. Yeah, so right. that, was, that was important. Yeah. Well, I really appreciate you, uh, you taking the time to speak with us about this. And um, where should uh, people go if they want more information well, on the platform? Sure. You can reach out to me directly anytime. Or I think probably on the web, it's emerson.com slash education. Okay, great. Well, appreciate you taking the time. Sure, thank you. Take care. Until next time. Yeah.